Hello, first grade. I hope you guys are doing well today. Okay, so for this week's project, I had you guys read a story about a boy named Ramon, um, and the story was titled Ish. So if you guys did not get a chance to hear me um, read the story, please listen to that video so you can kind of get a better understanding of what we're going to do today, okay? All right, so um, you guys are going to, I'm going to do this two ways. So I'm going to do, um, I'm going to do this one way where we are using watercolor and then I'm going to do this another way where I'm drawing, okay? So what you're going to want to do is, and this goes for the other one too. So just get your paper, fold it in half like a taco okay you're gonna want to cut that in half okay you want to um, do option one and option two it's up to you but you you only have to choose one option okay but both options you have to cut the paper okay so you're gonna fold it again into a, another taco, a smaller taco. Okay. And then you're gonna cut it. Okay. So you're gonna need four pieces each. Okay. So this is for my watercolor project. Okay. And this one's for my other project, so option two, and we'll come back to that later. Okay, so now that I have four pieces of paper, so in the story Ramon, he was always drawing and he can never just figure out how to make it right. So he would just get his papers and he would crumble it up. So that's what you're gonna do. <laughs> you're gonna do this four times. Crumble it up, crumble it all up. Just like Ramon, and he was like, oh, I quit. Crumble it up, crumble it up. Okay, so I have four pieces of crumbled up paper, okay? I'm gonna open up my watercolor, I'm gonna get my paintbrush, and I'm going to dip it in the water, okay? So I have my paper, so I'm gonna get some water. I'm gonna choose whatever color I want. Maybe I will do red. Okay, so I'm going to get my paintbrush full of the red watercolor paint and I'm just going to paint here and there and all over. Okay, so your hands are going to get kind of dirty. So just beware, kiddos and parents. Okay, I'm going to turn it over. I still have a lot of water on my paintbrush. I don't have to dip my paintbrush again unless you have to, that's fine. I'm just gonna go ahead and go in again. How about over here? How about over there? Anywhere. Okay. Just kind of painting here and there. Okay, I'm gonna put my paintbrush in that water there, clean it off. And what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna open it up. Okay. And again, your fingers are gonna get dirty. It's okay, we can wash them later. Okay, I'm gonna flatten this out. Okay, and I'm gonna crumble it up again. Okay, hands are getting dirty, no problem. And I'm gonna switch colors now. Maybe I'm gonna do green. And I'm just gonna go ahead and just go in green all over. Okay. I'm just gonna paint all over green. Just get all in those little cracks there. Paint over the red. Okay, put my paintbrush back in that water and I'm gonna open her up very carefully. And wow, so now I have some green on there. Pretty cool, right? Okay, so now I'm gonna crumble her up again. Okay, and I'm gonna use one more color. How about purple? Purple is a good color. And I'm just gonna paint all those spots there that I can see that's white. I'm gonna paint it all up in purple. Okay. Okay, 
I'm gonna blow on it just a little bit so I can dry a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna open her up and see what it looks like now. Ooh, very cool. Okay, so now I'm just gonna put that one to the side so it can dry, flatten it out. Okay, and I'm gonna do it again with another paper. Maybe, and if you guys just did it once, that's fine. You don't have to do it as many times as I am, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and go red again. I'm gonna make sure all of it is red this time, like everything. So if you guys only want to do it once, that's fine, okay? But if you wanna keep going, you totally can. Make sure all of it is painted in red. Get a little bit more water there. Get all of those spots that I can see there. All of it red. Okay, clean my brush. And blowing it just a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna open her up. And see what I got here. Ooh, this looks really cool. Okay, I'm gonna make sure it's a little bit more dry. Okay, I'm gonna crumble it up again. hands dirty. Okay, and now I'm going to use blue. I haven't used blue yet. Okay, just paint all over. Anywhere I see white, I'm going to paint it blue. Alright. Okay, clean my brush. Open her up. Ooh, this one looks really cool. Kind of looks like tie-dye. Very neat. Okay. Okay, and I'm going to open it up. Put it there so it can dry. And I'm going to do one more. Okay. How about... Let's go ahead and go purple first. Okay, so I'm still painting it purple here. all over purple. Okay, I'm gonna clean my brush there. Open her up. Ooh, very cool. Okay, I'm gonna crumble it up again. Color it in a different color. How about orange? I haven't used orange yet. Open it up. Ooh, very, very cool. Okay, so I'm gonna leave that there. So I just did three. This one I'll just put to the side there, okay? Okay, so, and then I'm next I'm gonna teach you guys how to do option two if you don't have any watercolors, okay? Okay, guys, so this is for um, option two. So this is if you do not have watercolors but you still wanna do the project, okay? Okay, so I have three papers here. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to draw on them, okay? So just like Ramon, he would draw flowers, he would draw like a vase with the flowers. Whatever you wanna draw is totally up to you. So this one, I'm just gonna draw just a flower. So I have like a little circle. And then I'm gonna add some petals. One, two, 
three, and four. Okay, I'm gonna add a little stem. I'm gonna add a little leaf. A little line in the middle there. Okay, so I have a flower like that. I'm just gonna put that to the side. And then this one here, I'm gonna add like a vase. Something like that. Maybe you wanna add some decorations to these. Whatever you wanna do. Okay, and then this one I'm gonna add a lot of flowers. So one, two, three, four. I'm gonna add one here. One, two, three, four. Add one here. One, two, three, four. One here. One, two, three, four. Okay, and now I'm gonna put some stems and it's gonna look like it's inside of the vase. Maybe one there. Hmm. About it curves a little bit. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Um sorry, I wanna make this a little bit straighter. I'm gonna erase this here. Okay, and then I'm gonna put that one to the side. And then how about this one? I'll just make um how about some clouds? Okay, how about some grass? Some stems? Some more little flowers? Maybe like a little leaf there and there. Okay, something like that. Whatever you want to do. Something that Ramon would do, right? Okay, so now this is the fun part. So Ramon gets frustrated and he doesn't like his work and he crumbles it all up, right? So we're going to do the same thing. Okay, so crumble it up. Crumble it all up. Just like how Ramon would do it. Crumble it all up. Crumble it all up. Okay. And then open them up. Just like how his sister opened them up and she saved them. Perfect. Oh, that one tore. That's okay. Okay. And we are done, guys. So just do one option. You don't have to do both of them. Either the watercolor option or maybe you wanted to do the drawing option. Totally up to you. Okay? I hope you guys have a great day. Happy Wednesday. I will see you back on Monday. Miss you guys. Bye.